Have you seen this shit? Have you seen this shit? All of this shit. As you can probably tell, I've been practicing this game a lot in my in my past time. So, uh, yeah, there isn't really any way for me to lose now, is there? Well, I mean, yeah, I could set up a good base, but that doesn't necessarily mean I'm impervious to the horrors of the adventure mode. But hey, we're still going to give it a good old college try because I've been practicing with this robotic motherfucker for way too long. Let's get the pain started. And here we are, back again with our little old portal to hell right here. Let's just jump on through. Because, hey, why wh hey, why just delay the pain? Let's do this. Please be archipelago. Please be archipelago. Please be archipelago. Please, I want to go see the Summer Isles. God damn it, the game is afoot. Well, you know what, the game is afoot isn't too bad. But it still starts you off in winter, which I hate. Because fuck winter. Now here's the thing that I got wrong last time, is that I was prioritizing getting to the objective as fast as possible, rather than being prepared to get to the objective as fast as possible. And, oh! I didn't even see the cobblestone road there. That's uh, pretty nice. That's pretty nice. That's actually very, very nice. W wonder what kind of death that's going to lead us to. And I also found out that if you just spam the X button, you can just chop this way quicker instead of just holding it down. That's some uh, pro tips, definitely. 100%. You should definitely trust me. You will not find any better player, except for, you know, maybe about half the people that play this. So I'm going to be prioritizing materials a bit more than getting to the objective. That doesn't mean I'm just going to give up entirely on the objective. I'm just going to take time to prepare more and think out what I'm going to do next. That's never a bad thing. That's always a good thing. Because if you see any of those survival movies where all the people die in the end, you know what they didn't do? Actually fucking try to think out what they're doing and, instead of just going for it. I'm looking at you, Gray. Oh hey, there's Chester. Now we have a little meat shield. Perfect. God, I'm way too used to the DLC by now. Because as we saw before, I was practicing with the DLC and not the actual, uh... Oh, fuck you. Come here. Oh, you fucking take my meat, bastard. That's mine. I'm taking your fucking nest, too, just because you're being a jackass. Now, the thing is I like about the game of the foot is that it's not permanent winter. It only starts you off at a certain point in winter. I'm not entirely sure when, but winter does end at some point. Oh, I oh come on. One more, yeah, let her shit. Oh. Come on, come here. You know you want to drop silk. Ugh. Ugh. Now, where was the start? Okay, let's see if uh, this fire is still burning. Hopefully. Yes, it is. Just barely. Okay, let's get the thing started up. Tomorrow we begin the hunt for all these items. And it's not going to go well. But who cares? We're here to suffer. Because I'm a, apparently a masochist. And I don't just want to keep stabbing myself in the leg doing this. I mean, not that it's a bad game. This is a fucking fantastic game. It's just that I hate, hate adventure mode. And whoever the hell I'm going to unlock better be worth it. The person I get at the end of this better be Chancellor Palpatine levels of unlimited power. Because I am not going through this for anything less. Oh, this, uh, yep, this is the definite spider lair. Fuck you. Fuck you and everything you stand for. Fuck all of you. <laughs> Burn, you horrible bastards. Burn! <laughs> oh god, I hate that trap. How much monster meat do you have? I never have any luck with spiders, they always just give me monster meat. Yeah, see, this is the point where wicker would be a really good option. Does anyone have to run around looking for science? But, I'm thinking long term. You gotta think long term with this. You can bring gold from each world, so, you know, it's just more of a starting thing if you want to pick wicker. 
In case you're wondering why I'm keeping my sanity so low, is because there are obelisks that require certain sanity levels for them to work. So let's say I, come, I run into a wall of obelisks, I would have to be completely nutters for the to actually open up to me. Balls to you. And your house. Get shit. Burn, spider, burn. I said burn already. Sorry, if I'm ch frequently checking the map, just making sure I'm not, I'm not running into any sort of death. Which I most likely am. Is this just a little circle right here? There we are. See? Look, it all worked in the end. Oh, hey, there's another bloke with a torch. Thank you. Free torch. Let's uh, investigate this, shall we, Scoob? Balls to you. Your giant testicle with legs. Oh my shit. Okay. Thank you, developers. Thank you. Thank you from the bottom of my balls. Thank you. This is just perfect. This is the in uh, this is the actual cancer I was always wishing for. Now kill some of these things for uh, for meat. I could always do with some of that good meat. Who the hell doesn't like meat? I mean, vegans don't like meat. So, I just answered myself. Good work, me. Man, my sanity is just tanking it right now. I'm gonna go insane in a second, aren't I? Yep, there it is. Over here. There we go. And top hat. Look at that dapper bastard. Come here, y'all lanky prick. I'll stab you right in your fucking face testicle. Now, am I just in an area filled with rocks? It looks like I am. Shit. I might have to go back. Don't you love this part of the game? We just wait around and do jack shit. It's my favorite as well. You see, ladies and gentlemen, that is the epitome of comedy right there. Good god, I'm bad. Will this night end, please? I want to go and get my shit. Are we around here somewhere? There it is. Oh, baby. Oh, my honey. Hello, my ragtime girl. Let's go kill them. I win. I get gears, bitch. Oh, no. Fuck you and everything you said. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Piss off, piss off. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh god, that was a bit too close, a bit too risky, holy, holy shit, okay then, let's heal, heal up, for fuck's sake, okay, let's uh, take a little bit of a different route with that, wow, I just got my absolute shit pushed in. Oh god, get them and run, get them and run, get, get the gears. Oh, fuck you. You are screwed, my friend. You are absolutely fucked. Yes. I actually did it. Wow. Uh, either way, I've got gears and I win. I just, I just, I just immediately win. My health bar just pulled a John Cena. You couldn't see it and it's time was now. But I pulled through because these gears are completely overpowered. Yeah, I've got to head back because I need logs back. God damn it. Well then, I guess we have to head back in. For fuck's sake. <laughs> the game is afoot again. Just shove one of those spiky trees up your fucking rectum, developers. Because this is absolute nonsense. I can't believe you gave me the game is afoot twice in a fucking row. Now, here comes the reason why I hate this fucking mode so much. is because you have to restart dart all the goddamn time because one slip up can just fuck you right in the mouth oh 
I'm just noticing all the dead bushes around. Are we gonna have this little old gimmick? It looks like we are. Well, then, honey baby. This is just gonna be great for my health, isn't it? Even though, like I specified in the last video, metal shouldn't be damaged by little wooden thorns. Because, you know, logic exists, kind of, not really, in this universe. Actually, no, there isn't any logic in this universe. Never mind. You know what? Fuck it. Metal is just as, thus, as soft as skin. It's canon now. Metal is as soft as human flesh. That went better than I expected. Holy shit, my fucking health. Wow, they do a lot more damage than I thought. Oh wait, never mind. I just remembered this guy's a little weak bitch at the start. God damn it. How many fucking spiders? How many fucking spiders are in the woods? Oh, it's a clockwork bridge. How do you do de da da da? Our prayers have been answered, and we have discovered the land of OP. I don't know, should I go for it? I feel like I should go for it, but then again, I feel like I'm just gonna dur and die. Dur and die. That's that's my motto. That's what I live by every day of my life. I gotta get those gears. Yeah, fuck it. I'm gonna wing it. I'm gonna wing it. Wing it. Follow the steps of the birds over there and just wing it. Hey, little uh, creeper crawly bastard. Why don't you stick your name and Shad don't come over here? Come on, I'm gonna get you. Shit. Yes, gears. Give me that. Oh, that's a lot better. Oh god, my axe had to break then, didn't it? Why did it make a pickaxe? Why did it make a second pickaxe? Why the fuck did it make a second pickaxe? I didn't want a second pickaxe. Show me the pickaxe to share this fucking spider. Fuck you. Fuck you and everything you stand for. How much do you love the fact that every time I try to pick up a fucking stick, I have to hurt myself? Don't you love it? I love it. I love it so much, I just want to stab it right in its kidney. You know, that's that's what true love is. Just having that undeniable urge to stab it right where its little pee process is. Tedious. Good fucking god. I want to find the gold rock, I want to get the spear. I want to go slaughter some beef below right here. Hey, ho, how you go? To the beef below. God, I need to make some kind of progress or else this has all been for naught. You know, at least one of the bridges is something that benefits me. Especially when it involves this. What have I done to you? Motherfucker, he tried to headbutt you. It's self-defense. That's what it's called. Besides, aren't you supposed to be a soulless automaton? Aren't you supposed to not feel for anything? Look at your fucking eyes. They're black. There's nothing in your eyes. You are a soulless creature spawned from human ingenuity. Truly the most terrifying thing in the world. You probably don't even want to be alive right now, do you? No, you just want to be a husk. Keep on just being. I got a newsflash for you, pal. This is real life. You gotta live what you got. Even though what you got ain't gonna help you live at all because we're doing this. God, it's pretty alone out here. That savannah I saw a little bit ago, I'm just praying that there are some bee fellows over there I can talk to. Oh wait, hold on. Isn't that a marsh with all those uh, twig trees? Yeah, so if I wanted to, I could go over there, chop some of those trees and get sticks that way instead of having to take away my health every time. Actually, that sounds like a way better idea. Why don't I go do that? Oh, because it's blocked by all these clockworks? Oh, well, there's your end. There's your problem. Hey, boss. Fuck you, man. I'm taking your bridge. Balls to you. Hold on. This is a second bridge. No, it's just the thing that's here. Or is this area just half marble, half swamp? 
Uh, this is some weird world generation. I think it was trying to have the bridge extend out farther, but it didn't register that there was already land right next to it. So then we ended up with this. Weird. Wait, no. Oh, there's also just a random clock we're at work out here for no reason other than, hey, how's it going? You don't kite me. You are the one that gets kited, sir. I guess you could say, with what I'm gathering right now, that I'm gearing up for the next world. You like it? I bet not. I bet you fucking hate me. <laughs> and no. These are not the only puns that I have. I have many more. What did you think you were getting yourself into? A series called The Punishing Wilderness. What else would you expect? You know, at least these boulders are unguarded, unlike those ones that near the birds. Because now I can really start suiting up and getting work done. Well, at least we've made some progress here today. I mean, hey, we did get our shit pushed in by a flock of birds. Actually, if they were crows, I guess you'd call them a murder. But all bad jokes aside, thank you for watching this. And I hope you enjoy my new mic. I'm really hoping that this turns out well in editing because I did not I did not spare any expense on this mic. Actually, I did because, you know, it was on sale. So I guess in a way I did spare expense. Anyway, yeah, we're, uh, we should almost be through this. We, we're, we're definitely prepared enough to go grab everything. We just have to actually go grab everything, which is the, which is the hard part. Ugh, god damn it. I hate this game mode so very, very much.